Run day fun day. It's that time again. Welcome back to Rate My Park Run. Running enthusiasts, welcome back to the channel. Today we'll take you on a fantastic journey through the Wolfham Abbey Park Run, Gunpowder Park. So lace up your running shoes, because this is a park run you don't want to miss out on. As we're walking up to the start, or warming up as we go up to the start, I'm just sharing with you the GPS map of the course itself. So it's two and a bit loops around Gunpowder Park in Waltham Abbey. The course itself is all on pavement, winding through the beautiful wooded areas of this park. It's mostly flat with some gentle slopes, making it perfect for runners of all levels, but also perfect for some PBs. So get those that super fast runners on, could be a quick one today. And always remember, no park run will be complete without its amazing volunteers, which is evident this park run as a great community from start to finish. These folks are the real heroes. So if you're not feeling the run today, get down to your local park run and have a volunteer. Great fun. So you can see the start line here as we're walking up, try and find your position. You can see from the first person view, we're about midway through here. And there's a nice nod to the London Olympics, the 2012 emblem there. And that's the start point of this park run. Three, two, one, let's get park running and rate this amazing park run. Check out these views already. Running here feels perfect. The definition of a park run, that's for sure. The cam footage was taken at six in the morning. So the time has started and we're on our way. The course, as I mentioned, is clockwise two and a bit laps. The route is fairly simple and has just one left turn. The rest of the route follows the main paths of the park and there will be marshals along the way just to guide you and offer in words of encouragement of course that's the beauty of the park run so this is a start and we're just going to veer around to the right here this generally is where people congregate at the beginning and give the park run briefing and you'll see a lot of park runners in the community just all congregating around this area there was a gym facility there and there were some people doing some uh, circuits and this is six in the morning as I mentioned I've got the drone footage so the park is already popular at that time and it's a great park to come to be it a park run or just a general run or do some training because the loops are perfect for speed work and some hill works depending on what you're after so there is a small car park does get very busy and parking is restricted here the charges are around a pound the first hour and then two pound for any time after that for up to 24 hours park run does ask that you don't park outside the park or on the verges outside the park so we've just gone up the slight incline here we're a minute 50 in and we're just cruising along nicely. As always, we'll switch between drone footage and first person footage as well to give you a real immersive viewpoint of this park run. It is a fantastic course, and as I've mentioned, it's a fast course. It is one you can get a good PB on. It's a fantastic run, the course is beautiful throughout, the real definition of a park run that's for sure and the atmosphere here is really encouraging. I always come back to this park run, especially if I'm after a fast one. Easy to get to, car parking is really accessible. There are housing estates nearby where you can find some ample street parking as well and plenty of entry points to this park. And just look at those fantastic views. You can't be it. So we're flying down a nice decline here and then we're going to veer to the left. Three minutes in, heart rate's getting up there. Hopefully you've already done a warm up 
so you're at your most optimal for this run. I'm going to veer around to the left now. There you work. Approaching the first kilometre marker now. As we veer around to the right, just breathing it in. Checking the watch out. And that's our first kilometre. So you know where the first kilometre marker is now. Note that down. And with 4 minute 22, we think we run through that. We're at a nice pace at the moment. Good work. Some good runners here. So this park run event at Gunpowder Park Run, they've had over 580 events as of filming this. Over 11,000 finishers. Volunteers, they've had almost 500 volunteers and over 12,000 PBs. The average finish time of this park run is 29 minutes and 30 seconds. They no longer show the PBs for males and females, but as these videos get more popular, please put in your PB for this run and we can pin the top PBs for each people who comment on each course. It'd be great to see what fast times we can get, but age groups, and genders alike. Park Run is a fun social event. But we do push ourselves to the limit on this park run and we're always striving to improve. I always find it's good to see other people's speeds and PBs just for encouragement and some motivation. So we're around the back of the park now, some cracking views with the drone. Season in, six minutes in. We're gonna approach a nice wooded area here, a tunnel of trees we're gonna be running through. There is a slight incline here, but concentrate on your form, breathe in the environment, and just start reeling those other runners in if you're not right at the front, which I am never right at the front on this part run, that's for sure. Little first person footage for you we're chasing these chaps down in front just look at those views please don't forget to like comment comment your PB's comment your favorite parts of this course comment how many times you've done this course Comment where you go for a post-run coffee afterwards. So we're 2k in now. We are flying along over a mile in and 2k down. Smashing it. So please like, comment, share this video for anyone who's interested in park run or doing some runs around Gunpowder Park. Get a good idea of what you can expect. One of the great things about Park Run is the communities and the volunteers couldn't happen without them and at this Wolfram Abbey Park Run they do mention on their Park Run page they're always about for a post run community coffee 
Everyone gathers for a well-deserved coffee and a chat, post run, sharing stories, and that's how we make friends and make part run part of our culture. There is some great places to go afterwards. I normally catch up with friends randomly at the McDonald's down the road. It's a five minute drive, a 15 minute walk. A nice coffee in there. Post run analysis, looking for your Stravas. See what points were fast, see what points were tough and see who was the fastest on the day. This is really close to Lee Valley Whitewater Rafting Centre which was used during the 2012 Olympics. Fantastic place to go afterwards. More sporting inspiration around that area. So if you've got time after this park run, definitely recommend going up there. So first person viewpoint, we've just took a left here, turning down towards the start line for our first lap to be completed. And we've flown along. Nine minutes, 20 in. We do have a Strava group where I post all these courses within that Strava group at Rate My Park Run. We've got over 26 members at the time of filming this video, but the more members, the more videos we get to post and the more engagement we get. We can have some great fun with these videos in the future. So we've just come past the start line and we're approaching our first lap. So well done. We're flying along now and we're going to veer around to the right shortly. On this part run, I was running in vapor flies and we are motoring along. And this is the main incline on this course as it veers round to the left. But no, you've got a nice decline after you get to the top and you can really push with some pace down the decline onto a flat surface. So on the drone footage, to give you a perception of what sort of pace I was running, there's seven minute, 10 miles we're running on that drone footage. And we sink it in with a first person view as best we can. So this is around the seven minute, 10, seven minute, 15 minute mile pace. So this is generally flat now after the incline. We're well over halfway now. And we're flying along downhill. We'll be veering around to the left to the back of the park the second time. 3K in, 12 minutes 41, not a bad pace at all. Mates running beside you. Saturday mornings don't get much better than this. Check out that nice horizon. Our bodies are in full motion now. Heart rate's up. We're motoring along. 
feeling a few hours ago when you thought to yourself, oh, I can't be bothered with this this morning. That's long gone. And there's no better way to start the day. So we're flying around to the left now. Your mate beside you. 30 minutes in. We can have a little race. I don't think so. So please like, comment, share this video. Let us know what you like about this course. But most of all, pop in your PB for this course as well. It'd be good to see some times that people have genders, age groups. This could be a real rapid course for anyone who's into their running, jogging, walking, walking fiercely. That's what Park One's about. From those front runners that inspire a lot of club runners to the towel walkers that inspire those who want to gap on a Saturday morning and make a difference. That's the beauty of Park Run. We've all got to do the same distance. It's all just as hard for each individual. Because some people finish it faster than others. To get into the park run by foot there are pedestrian and cycle access points all along the park multiple entry points to the park We're coming up to one now actually getting there by public transport the nearest rail stations are Enfield Lock and Wolfham Cross both of which are approximately 30 minute walk to the field station to get into Enfield Lock you can also walk to Preston Gardens and take a bus the 491 towards Wolfram Cross to Gunner Drive stop. And getting there by road, which a number of people will do. Gunpowder Park is situated to the north of Greater London, just south of the historic Wolfram Abbey and the M25, between junctions 25 and 26. Postcode they put on their website is EN9 free golf pepper and we're at the back of the park with 4k in just 1k left we are flying along 16 minutes in our mate's still with us we're still reeling these runners in we're doing our best to get the best time we can our mates just took us over we're having a little race there's a bit of wacky races going on and we're going through the nice tunnel of trees just a kilometer left this is where the business end of park run comes in and we all decide, hang about, I'm going for it. Flying through the trees with the drone. We ain't losing him. Keep going. This is Rate My Park Run. Plenty of rating of park runs to come. Drone footage, first person, Insta360 footage. Just to really immerse yourself within this park run. Sit back, relax, rip apart my running form if you wish. Pop in the comments your favourite parts of this park run or just enjoy the views, mute my voice, sit back, relax, and enjoy this beautiful park that was pretty much made for running and walking your dog in, pretty much. Eighteen minutes in now, Around 800, 700 meters to go. It's 
some runners have finished now doing their post run stretches but you are flying along it's just you and the paths and your mate who I think would be it Made my part run. As I mentioned at the beginning of the video, the drone footage itself was taken at 6 in the morning, and when I say this is one of the most relaxing parks to run in, it's just perfect. Tranquil, a few dog walkers, a few walkers. Great access, and there's plenty of smaller loops, some inclines for speed work. Now we're flying down for the last lap now, the final straight pretty much. This is where you engage your core, think about your running style. You're gonna be exhausted at this point if you've been pushing it. But this is where PBs are made. Flying down the back straight. Don't trip over that dog. Thanks again for watching. Please like, subscribe. We'll be catching you in the next Rate My Park Run as it evolves, as it develops. Hopefully you enjoy watching all the videos and get an idea of different park runs up and down the country. Let us know if this video inspired you to do this park run. And we'll catch you in the next one. So the final sprint now, past the start line. No one's catching now, reeling these runners and just keep pushing to the end. under 100 meters to go you know what's going to happen we're going to veer around to the right we're not going to go up that incline again we're going to be getting near the finish get all those runners in yes they're finished you'll be finishing the second so veer around to the right here this is where you'll be collecting your um, barcodes and handing them into the marshals everyone cheering you on and you can see the finish line now you're not going to go up that incline voila 5k done saturday morning in the bag already completed it mate thank you very much marshals without whom the park runs couldn't go ahead you've just done your park run 21 and a bit minutes so mates you know well done lads lovely jubbly Ah, beat you buddy, spuds, nice work. That's Gunpowder Part 1, catch you in the next one guys. Time for coffee methinks. See you next Part 1. Hopefully next time, it's on the beach with some sunshine. Run day, fun day.